All right, you guys, you already know what time it is. You want to make sure that you have all of your ingredients and your supplies that you need before you start anything. It'll make it easier on you and quicker. Um, I will put all of the ingredients down below and the measurements. So here I am just going to be mixing all the ingredients together. Very easy, very quick. And I would recommend that you put half of the cinnamon in first and then the other half later on. So that way the first few breads won't get all of the cinnamon. And then you just mix, 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 mix. And I'm just going to transfer it into um, a little bit flatter one so that way it's easier to soak the bread in. Now this is the fun part. All right, you guys, it is time to cook these bad boys. So here I'm just adding butter in my pan. You don't have to be shy on the butter there. All right, so for each bread, you want to cook it on each side for about two to three minutes and then flip it over and do the same thing. So I just realized that this looks so mouth-watering, but you can't hear anything. So next time you guys, I promise I will leave this sound on. Okay, I want you guys to hear the sizzle and act like you can actually smell the aroma that is coming up off of these breads. You guys, my favorite part is coming up. Yes, powder, sugar, these bad boys, okay? And don't be stingy with it. I'm telling you guys, you need to make this for your mom. She will not be disappointed. Here is the finished results and I am telling you, you will not be sorry that you made these. In fact, you might not even want to give them to your mom, but you should. <laughs> and then you should make some for yourself. Alright you guys, so we are about to make some strawberry banana skewers. This is very quick and easy and I promise you your mom will love this unless she is either allergic to one of the two or she just doesn't like one of the two. You can always use different fruits if you like, um, but I just like to make these because I want to make my mom feel appreciated and I know yours will too. So everything is pretty self-explanatory. You just cut these up into some thick cuts, not too thin and not too thick either, um, but you want them more thick than thin.
Alright you guys, so I went and got an extra plate here and I put the other one back in the house. So I have my skewers and all you want to do is basically just assemble it. Um, banana strawberry, banana strawberry, or the other way around, whichever one you want. I think I will start off with um, a banana. So you just grab one and stick it through the middle and you just push it all the way down and then you get another piece okay and then you basically just keep doing that your apple cold stick and you do as much of these as you can and my son's birthday is coming up as well so i think i'm going to do this for him also because i love the way these turn out I love assembling them. They're very fun to do. Very, like I said, quick and easy. All right, you guys. Our moms now have a healthy, delicious, and hearty breakfast that they can enjoy first thing when they wake up. And I hope you enjoyed watching this video. I enjoyed making it. And make sure you stay tuned for part two.